Hey everybody. DICE just released the 8th edition of its tech job report, covering the first half of 2022, and I wanted to take a moment to break down some key points for you. First, in the first six months of the year, we saw a strong, sustained demand for tech talent. How strong? The number of tech job postings rose 45% since the beginning of the year, and up 52% compared to the first half of 2021. And yeah, there's some economic uncertainty. Some folks are worried about a recession. There was a hiring spike in May, followed by a decline in June. But that dip was also a seasonal trend we've seen in past years. No matter what the state of the economy, the fact is that companies will always need tech talent for everything from building websites to maintaining tech stacks. If the recent layoff and hiring freeze trends in tech make you think twice about working in this particular field, remember that technologies are needed in virtually every single industry, and not just you know the tech-focused ones, the tech-focused companies, it's everything, manufacturing. Everybody needs technologists these days. Second point, we're seeing tech job posting growth nationwide. Newer, smaller tech hubs are attracting significant talent, while hiring in traditional tech hubs like Silicon Valley remains strong. Technologists still have opportunities to work anywhere, and they're doing just that. Third, employers are on the lookout for data-related skills, whether that's SQL, Python, or even more specialized tools and platforms. This trend will only continue as more organizations master the storage and processing of data, especially in the cloud. Fourth, and here's the big takeaway for technologists, no matter what your stage of your career, the key to landing various roles that are open to technologists is to always keep your skills up to date. Organizations want technologists who have mastered the tools and platforms that are you know, obviously key to their businesses. Don't forget, given the demand for technologists at the moment, you can also potentially negotiate with your current employer for training and educational opportunities, among other perks and benefits. So for much more, including some key stats about the current tech jobs market, check out the latest edition of DICE's Tech Job Report. Thanks.